Mountains. This work encompasses 8 through 11 of Campina Andalusa by Sabicas. Today, let's learn it. First, I'm going to play this super slowly, then a little faster while counting, and finally, I'll explain everything I'm doing. Here's super slowly. <laughs> super slowly. Now let's play it a little faster while counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, Sorry, I got distracted by a mosquito, I think, that just flew by. Alright, so let me give you a detailed explanation about uh, what I'm doing exactly. So first of all, this is a falsetta for pulgar technique. Pulgar is um, basically thumb, attack like this, but it comes a little bit from the wrist. So not just uh, the thumb itself, but the wrist. This kind of motion. So this is your first harmony. Index finger, 4th fret, 5th string. Pinky, 7th fret, 4th string. And in the right hand you play this. 654, 654, 654, 454 four, four with golpe. Now look, 654 is played uh, in one sweeping motion like this. So kind of imagine that you, you want to arpeggiate the chord with a thumb. So it's the same thing here. So 654, 654, 654, 444 four, four with golpe. Now golpe by itself after a pause. And then you play 654, 444, 444, hammer on, 654. But in the left hand, this is what's happening. Then I put the ring finger on the 6th fret of the 4th string, then play that 3 times. Now put the middle finger on the 5th fret of the 4th string, play that 3 times, and then hammer on that 3rd finger again on the 6th fret of the 4th string, and then place this chord on. So where the middle finger is on the 5th fret of the 5th string and the ring finger on the 6th fret of the 4th string and play that with the thumb, right? And then do the golpe. Let me play that last part one more time. Now, leave the 
Discord on and uh, play 6 by 4 in the right hand by the thumb. But you see, there's something we're adding here, and that's the melisma by the pinky. So we have a hammer on on the 7th fret of the 4th string, and then pull off to the 6th fret, which is under the ring finger. Now look, remove the ring finger, put the index finger on the 4th fret of the 4th string, and then ring finger back, and then the pinky on the 7th fret. So, like this. All by the thumb in the right hand. Now, the index finger should go on the 4th fret of the 3rd string. Play that with the thumb. And then the pinky goes to the 6th fret of the 3rd string. And slides up to the 7th uh, fret. From here to here. But, instead of playing that note by itself, we play it with a chord. Like this. And that's 6, 5, 4, 3 in a, in a thumb. In one sweeping motion. So I'll play that part one more time. Golpe. Leave this chord on. Now play out of this chord just 6th. Uh, 5th and 4th strings in one sweeping motion and then 3rd string by itself all by the thumb now that's under the pinky now the pinky should slide back to the 6th fret for the next note and then index finger goes to the 4th uh, fret of the 3rd string we had it there before already and then pinky goes to the 7th fret of the fourth string and then remove it and that's under the third finger that's your sixth fret of the fourth string so I'll play that part one more time pinky slides now go back to the first chord wait and golpe so that's fourth fret of the fifth string this is seventh fret of the fourth string now, look, and after the golpe, you play this, 6, 5, 4, 6, 5, 4, 4 with golpe. Then place the 3rd finger on the 6th fret of the 4th string and play that, play this, 6, 5, 4, 6, 5, 4. And then the middle finger goes on the 5th fret and you play that with golpe. 5th fret of the 4th string. Alright, so it's like... But there is one more element that I haven't explained and that's the index finger plays the open 1st string after the golpe at the end. Both times. Look. Golpe, index finger. So, 6, 5, 4, 6, 5, 4, 4, with golpe, 1, 6, 5, 4, 6, 5, 4, 4, with golpe, 1. Alright, now look, um, play the open 5th string, hammer on with the pinky on the 4th fret, now place the index finger on the 2nd fret of the 4th string, and then play the open third string. And that's all done with the thumb. Like thumb, hammer on, thumb, thumb. And the strings here are five, hammer on, four, three. Now remove everything and place the, uh, the, the pinky on the fourth fret of the third string and the index finger on the second fret of, this, of the third string. So they're both on the third string and then pull off from the pinky to the index finger and then from the index finger to the open string like this and then do the same thing on the fourth string same exact frets four and two okay and then pinky goes to the fourth fret of the fifth string now and then you play the open fourth string 
by the thumb. So. this chord that's a uh, bar uh, across three strings on the second fret and uh, the middle finger is on the third fret of the second string and then you play second string with the index finger in the right hand and then thumb slides from the third string to the second to the first and the first string is with a gold pin so now, third finger hammers on, um, hammers on here on the fourth fret of the fourth string, and we remove the bar, and you play this. Fourth string, second string, now place the index finger on the third fret, and then repeat, and then play 4th string and 2nd string uh, quickly almost together like slightly broken so in the right hand is thumb index thumb th th thumb index thumb thumb index quickly and uh, the strings 4 2 Now, slide back with the third finger and place uh, to the second fret of the fourth string and place the pinky on the second fret of the second string and play this. So. So in the right hand it's the same thing. Four, two, four, four, two, four, four, two. And thumb index, thumb, thumb index, thumb, thumb index. And as you see, that melody note that changes, that's with the uh, second finger, which is uh, placed on the on the first fret of the fourth string. So um, I'll give you the frets. Two, two, one. Remove everything and um, play four, two, four, four, two, four by the thumb. So thumb and index finger. Thumb, index, thumb, thumb, index, thumb. Now look, place these two fingers on the second fret. So that's fourth string, and this is um, this is second string and second finger and play thumb index and then remove and play uh, the fourth open string so all together is this and finally you place these fingers here uh, third finger on the fourth fret of the fifth string and index finger on the second fret of the third string and play that with thumb and index finger so five three and then gold pin this brings you to the tremolo section that uh, i already recorded earlier so you can learn that as well so i'll play one more time um, a little bit um, quicker so that you understand everything that's happening
things that you should know. First of all, there are extra golpes in there that uh, Sabikas didn't really intend. It's just the technique of pulgar. Sometimes, sometimes the wrist goes together with the thumb, and it kind of the ring finger lands on the on the guitar during this motion. So you hear golpe, but it's not really intended. This golpe is intended, but uh, this one is not. And um, the beginning of a lot of sweeps there features a golpe. It's barely heard, like... Like you hear this one. run I played this way but to me to my ears it sounded a little bit smoother the way that Sabikas play plays it so I thought for a while that it was played this way so 4 2 and then 5 4 2 0 like right I don't think that it's worth it. I mean, the added complexity of it is not worth the smoother sound. So uh, play it the way that I taught you. I think it's going to be better. All right, my friends, I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. Please let me know if I should change anything. And uh, I'll see you next time. Thank you.